Yeah, I think so. So uh, this game was uh, we can compare with the game against Fulham. It was the same uh, formation. Uh, we play, um, uh, I think, in the same way. We, we move the ball very well. Uh, we was my players was very professional, uh, very solid, very dis- with a very dis- a lot of, uh, a good discipline in the game. So it's why uh, we create. Uh, even they have uh, the first chance, but after we we start manage the ball, we score one goal. We lose uh, Westy and I lose the substitution with a situation that, in my opinion, is a clear red card. Let's see on TV if I have a reason or not. Uh, and the player even take a, a yellow card. After this, we scored one goal. We scored a second one. And they have a lot of doubts about the position of Rich also, but uh, the referee understand is not. Uh, it was offside. Um, uh, second half, uh, we I think we was better. So because we play most of the time in offensive pitch, we move the ball, we create chances again, we can score the second goal, we block like we did in Fulham the the ways to to our goal. So we don't give too many chances to 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 the Burton be near our our goal, and we take a goal. The difference it was that first we did not achieve the second, and we have a clear chances to achieve, and we achieve a goal in the throw. They can, I think um, my players don't deserve the way that they run, they fight, they play with a heart, they was disciplined, they don't deserve that uh, lose this, uh, lose this uh, two points. It became quite scrappy at times, didn't it? A lot of referees blowing his whistle, quite a few hefty challenges going in, balls going astray today, well for both teams, Burton and Sheffield Wednesday. Listen, I never saw in my life, I saw to the ref, I just said this, so I misrespected it, but I never saw uh, uh, attacking faults uh, like like today uh, from our side because in another, you never saw one fault uh, that the Burton attackers did one single time one in all the games but all the time that we put the ball to Gary Hooper special to Gary Hooper Gary Hooper is is not a tall player he's a clever player he used the body very well when we play against the guys more tall than him of course he must use the body this is football he's not this is not uh, uh, basketball is football, so he used the, the body to try to achieve a position to take the ball. 90% of the situation was fault. Break the rhythm of the game, break our attacks, break our positions to be near the goal. And uh, it was not good, so we, I didn't like, I said to the ref, I didn't like this uh, special this situation. It's not, we don't miss points because of him, but of course uh, when we go 20 times and 18 times it's all the time fault when the ball go to Gary Hooper, make an impact of course, because 18 times that we can go uh, to the goal is 18 times that they give a ball and they can to attacks. 18 attacks is too much. And maybe I've, uh, I've, uh, I'm, uh, um, I'm doing a favour because I believe that was more than 18 with, with another player.